There are plenty of people who want to buy such a versatile car as the Volkswagen Multivan, but not everyone can afford it. Accordingly, a used Multivan is in much greater demand than a new one. In this class of commercial vehicles, Volkswagen Multivan is considered the undisputed leader, which, in general, is confirmed by its by no means humane price tag. Moreover, in this case, the client pays not only for the progressive design and high quality of materials and workmanship, but also for the unprecedented durability and indestructibility of this car. There are cases when five six-year-old specimens from Europe rolled over 800,000 kilometers. Yes, it's not a typo. At the same time, the Multivan looked like new, and its technical condition could be assessed as far from pre-infarction, at least it was able to overcome another hundred or two. This is me to the fact that there are no used multivans with children's runs. Of course, there are rare exceptions when there are really well-groomed cars with modest numbers on the odometer, but they immediately go their separate ways. Moreover, the buyer, as a rule, does not even bargain, rejoicing at a profitable deal, why would God be angry if you were already lucky with the car? The generation of the Volkswagen Multivan, built on the D5 platform, debuted in early 2003 with R4 2.0 liter, 116 horsepower, and V6 3.2 liter, 231 horsepower, gasoline engines, as well as R4 1 turbo diesels, 9 liters, 105 horsepower, and R5 2.5 liters, 130 and 174 horsepower. A 5 speed manual gearbox was combined with 4 cylinder engines. The base transmission for the R5 and V6 is a 6 speed mechanics, and only a 6 band automatic was offered for the petrol V6. In addition, the 231 horsepower Multivan can be either front or all wheel drive. In terms of the quality of finishing materials and quality factor of assembly, the minivan is not inferior to other models of the concern. The car can accommodate 5 to 7 passengers. The possibilities for transforming the interior are worthy of the highest praise. The seats of the second row can be moved in the longitudinal direction, in addition, they are all able to rotate around their axis. A hidden panel in the paneling between the second and third rows is nothing more than a miniature table. A lot of different pockets, shelves and drawers are scattered throughout the cabin. Depending on preferences, it can be turned into a mini office, a meeting room, a children's room or a bedroom on wheels. A used Volkswagen Multivan can be found in both Spartan and Maximum configurations, with climate control in the rear, interior trim with precious woods or high textile with all-wheel drive and automatic, Xenon and an expensive multimedia system. On the secondary Ukrainian market, Multivan is represented by dealer cars, as well as those brought from Europe, and in almost equal proportions. Unlike all the previous ones, the fifth generation of the T5 family was not sold in the USA. Despite the minivan's outward appearance, breakdowns sometimes make themselves felt even during the warranty period, and spare parts and maintenance costs from dealers are very high. Therefore, when choosing a used copy, do not try to save on diagnostics, it will cost more. Volkswagen Multivan is more common with diesel engines. The resource of many of them at the time of sale can be practically exhausted, which means enormous costs, from replacing pump injectors and glow plugs to a fuel pump and engine overhaul. And keep in mind that a characteristic feature of the five-cylinder engines installed on the first T5 models is a traction failure at low engine speeds. Gasoline engines are less expensive to operate. Initially, a reliable 2.0-liter engine is recommended to check for wear on the cylinder piston group. The compression in the cylinders should be at least 9.3. The fact is that the base motor often has to be turned to maximum speed in order to move safely in the traffic stream. This leads to a loss of compression. Over time, the motor electrics may begin to mope, the ignition coil, oxygen sensors, throttle position and mass airflow. 6 is practically devoid of characteristic flaws, however, it is noticeably more expensive to maintain. The clutch serves an average of 150,000 km. Some careful owners change it at the 300,000 km. True, sometimes it has to be updated along with the dual-mass flywheel of the engine. In manual transmissions, the third gear flies out due to the weakening of the synchronizers. With age, the linkage of the lever becomes loose. Machines are reliable and durable. Mechanics advise changing gear oil every 90,000 km, although it is filled for life. In the suspension, more often than other elements, it is necessary to update the stabilizer struts and bushings, as well as the thrust bearings of the shock absorber struts. The engines are very cramped in the engine compartment, which greatly complicates their maintenance and repair, especially the larger gasoline V6. On five-cylinder turbo diesels, it is necessary to monitor the condition of the water pump, due to the design features of this engine failure of the pump threatens to ingress coolant into the engine lubrication system. 
If this happens, costly repairs will be needed. It is desirable to install the original part. It is better to refuel at network gas stations and change engine oil after an average of 8,000 kilometers. In order to prevent the injection system must be flushed with a special fluid. It is advisable to change the CV joints and the clutch assembly with the basket and the release bearing at the same time, after about 150,000 kilometers. This way you can save a lot on labor. In the front suspension, almost simultaneously with the struts and stabilizer bushings, the support bearings of the struts wear out. Ball joints and shock absorbers hold 100,000 km. In the rear suspension of the front-wheel drive versions, an H-shaped semi-independent beam is installed, and there is nothing special to break in it, except for the stabilizer struts and bushings. Shock absorbers, depending on the load and driving style, nurse from 90,000 to 150,000 km. All-wheel drive versions are equipped with an independent rear suspension, which also features high mileage.